From the deposits of Steinkopf in the Northern Cape of South Africa, here we have South Africa's version of the Alpine Quartzes. Uh, very interesting, most of these lie on a flat matrix, as you can see here. So from a display point of view, I would put it on a stand, and now we're going to go slowly through this. Now, under magnification, in some of these I'd find uh, little pyrite cubes trapped, in some of them I found the likes of little grey dusting of hematite. Totally water clear, as you can see. A mild, mild smokiness. This dusting you see on the outside would be micro quartz crystals. The color, color-wise, we're looking at a green to a gray to a to a smoky. Now, on some of these sections, I found the likes of micro epidote crystals as well. So I think the the predominant color of these is determined by, well, is caused by by the uh, epidote. Also, quite interesting about these uh, these alpine South Africans. Um, you have a lot of the uh, interesting extra windows or the diamond window on this quartz crystal. And as I move it around, it's as if the color, color almost appears to change at certain angles. All the way from South Africa, uh, here about 60 kilos north of the town of Springbok uh, in South Africa, close to a lot of the larger copper deposits of old.